so Darwin's an incredible place to work in the Northern Territory, the top end of Australia. It's, um, it's Australia's most isolated tertiary hospital uh, and serves a, a population of uh, First Nation Australians, Aboriginal Australians who have complex health needs but have a very diverse and rich culture. The, the, the variety you'd see in the anaesthetic surgical department is kind of, you wouldn't see it anywhere, like on one day I'd do anaesthetize a five month old um, for a fracture or something uh, and then the next next patient would be like a 75 year old with an ischemic bowel. So the Northern Territory Medical Program gives a really great wrap around of different specialist um, trainings and rotations that we can participate in as a student and you know the medicine up here is so unique you know 70% of the patients in uh, uh, top end hospitals, the Aboriginal Torres Strait Islander, so the, you know, there's a large focus on Indigenous health. So Darwin offers a very unique experience in um, exploring aspects of perioperative medicine. Um, a lot of the um, patients presenting to Darwin Hospital have significant comorbidities. Um, so with complex underlying problems um, yeah. presenting for complex surgery, um, there is a lot to sort through. Darwin is honestly such a beautiful place. It's so multicultural and both of us grew up here and kind of lived like such a tropical life. And it's definitely like a, a bit of an adventure being here. Um, it's very laid back in general. The culture of the town, the culture of the territory is very laid back. Um, and in that way, it makes it very welcoming. Medical opportunities that I found whilst on placement at Alice, Northern Boy, and Darwin were marvellous. Very, very, very um, inviting. I've just found the opportunity to broaden my personal, but most importantly, my professional boundaries up here. Absolutely limitless. The department's really close, but, you know, tight knit, super chilled. Um, everyone's really friendly. Darwin brings up special people, I think. <laughs> um, working here, like, everyone's so lovely. Yeah. And sure. it's such a, you get so many different patients um, that you wouldn't see down south. And the people that you see here, the medicine you see here, is just so interesting. And the support that you get to practice those skills, like, firsthand, is, I don't think you'll get any other place, really. As a medical student, I think one of the pulls towards ANSCAR is, as I've been on the rotation, the culture of you know the team they've been so inviting to even us as medical students, and I think that you know creating that positive environment from the ground up, we already felt so welcome and so supported. The STP programs provide us with an opportunity to have additional um, funded training positions in anaesthesia so we've been able to start to develop a, a, a NT cohort of trainees. Uh, so some of them have then gone on to other regional training programs but in collaboration with Alice Springs Hospital we're starting to now develop uh, an NT independent program with support from uh, major hospitals in Adelaide to provide some cardiac training and quaternary paediatric training so that we can provide the whole program in the Northern Territory and encourage people who often went to medical school here or came here as junior doctors to get into the anaesthesia training program and because we can now do three years of training in Darwin people can really uh, get into the Darwin lifestyle and establish the, their own life and their family's life up here so it's really been a, a huge uh, advance for us in the Royal Darwin Hospital. The local mentoring program um, has um, been um, heavily supported by um, the leadership in the department um, and all trainees are encouraged to have a mentor. Darwin, from a southerner's perspective, because I'm from Adelaide, seems like this little beautiful enigma of a, of a location in the north, you know, tropical, warm, sunny, camping, all that sort of stuff, the outdoorsy life. Um, albeit the ocean's a little trickier with the crocodiles. But despite that, um, it appeals as this beautiful, really rewarding city or town for people that like to spend their time outside. I just watch out for crocodiles. 